Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm Christopher with Plan Your Truth and in today's video I have some really exciting items to share with you from three different shops. So I just want to kind of dive in because there's a lot to share with you today uh, and I'm going to start with Mojo Jojo Plans. I'm super excited to now be an affiliate with her. So down in the description box you will see a, um, a link that you can use when shopping. It doesn't cost you anything extra but it does support me and this account. Um, but it also saves you some money because I have a code, Plan Your Truth, for 10% off your purchase. So I'm really excited. I have used this sticker book. Like, I, I talk about this in so many of my videos and talk about how I need another one. And she did a restock. So as of the time I'm filming this, all of this is still available. Um, I can't guarantee it still will be because they sell really quickly. So I'm going to film this and put it up on my channel as quick as possible. So hopefully you have the opportunity to shop. These are the four that uh, Jojo sent me. We are just going to flip through them so you can take a look. But she does have a ton of other books still on her site. So you can check those out as well. You have seen this book. A million times on my channel so we're gonna flip through this kind of quickly but this is my favorite sticker book of all time so we have two pages of these little boxes four of this next size now we're getting into my favorite sizes so we have four pages of this size and then I believe it's four pages of the box or the square as well this is my favorite size box. All right, now we get some full boxes and she really does fill the entire sticker sheet. So because there was a little extra room, we, just, we get some extras of those. I'm so excited that she's re-releasing this book. This is, I this book matches every spread. You could do decorative stickers and then use black boxes. Um, I love that we have some with journaling lines. That is really good if you want to make a to-do list or for like memory planning, or you just want to do some journaling. We got the double boxes, lots of different sizes on here. I'm going a little quickly because I use this book all the time, so I know you guys are familiar with it. But I 10 out of 10 recommend this book. Hopefully it's still available as of right now. It is, so definitely run over to her shop. Use code, code plan your truth. It takes a $20 sticker book down to an $18 sticker book which I think is such a steal for this like beautiful book. All right, let's next do this one. This is also one of her OGs that she is restocking. So this is called Rainbow Boxes. All right, so we start with a like rich red and then a deep, it's like a black red, like a deep, deep maroon. We get lots of different sizes on that sheet. And then we get some of my favorite sizes on this sheet. Some with the lines, with some extra little ones along the side. So it's gonna be that same couple of pages that we just saw, but now in the different colors. So now we have a deep orange and like a really light pastel, kind of pale orange with the same, with the same uh, sticker sheets. So there's four sheets in each colorway. Now we have a deep, like a beautiful rich yellow and a pastel pale yellow. Two sheets of that, one of this, and then the journaling lines. You can see how like rich this color is. I, I hope hopefully it's coming across on camera. All right, now we have a deep green and then, or like a bright green, I should say, and then a deep um, darker green. And did this change? Let me see. I want to say, yeah, this does change. So whatever the full box or the double box is, you get in both colors. That's why we do that. And then we have the blues. This is a beautiful, like, royal blue. And then this is like a baby blue. Oh, I'm so thankful to Jojo for working with me and um, having me on her team. I'm obsessed with like these books because it's just, you know, between all of her books, you have a box for any spread. She has so many different books. All right, deep uh, royal light um, purple. It's like almost like a lavender. 
And then we have some pink here. So we have like a, not quite a hot pink. It's a little bit more muted than that. And then like a pastel light pink there. Okay, and then the back is a little bit different. We have um, some like more greens and an orange here in this sheet. So you get all the different sizes on one sheet. And then these are like some funkier colors. So like a, a fun plum. This is like a almost like an olive green, but a little bit brighter. And then another like this is like a sky blue, baby blue. Let me find the blue just to compare. So this is much brighter than this, if that helps. And then what I can compare for this page, let's compare the greens. So this is similar, but this one on this set is a little bit brighter than this. This is a little bit more dark. And then this obviously is more pastel. So that is the um, Rainbow Boxes book. Now let's go into some of her new ones. So I'm really excited about this one, Big Neutral Boxes. As of the time I'm filming this, it's either sold out or like she has three left. So um, definitely check it out. But this is meant for the big uh, vertical planner. So the boxes are gonna be a little bit bigger. So we start with black. If you're interested in this book, I would run to her website and see if it's still available. As of the time I'm filming this, there are a few left. So um, we went from this page to some smaller sizes. And then we have the journaling lines. And these journaling lines are in a gray color. Whereas in this box, the lines were black. So they were a lot darker. They are a lot lighter in this one, like a light gray. Now, just because this is meant for the big planner, you can still use these in a classic. So this box, you could turn on its side and have it be like a little bit longer. It, the, the boxes still, in my opinion, work in any planner. So now we have like a dark gray color. Again, with the same pages repeated. And now we have a light gray, just to show the difference between those colors. And we're into a light gray with the large boxes, the littler boxes, and the journaling. Oh, now this is like a dark, dark brown. Like it almost could look black if you're far away from it, but it's a dark brown. Let me just show it up against the black so you can see. It does look different when you do it like that. <clears throat> a dark brown. And it looks like, so this would be the top of the box because you see how that line's like at the bottom there. So just in case you were wondering. All right, now we have a lighter brown to show the difference there. So we have black, two grays, two browns. This is such a cool idea. <clears throat> oh, and now an even lighter brown. So now we have another brown. This is almost getting into like tan territory. Same sheets for this color scheme. OMG, and now we have a different brown, but this one is almost like, like a like a nude kind of color. All right, and then we get a little bit of a mix on the last two pages. So we get some more double boxes in all of the different colors. So this shows all of the different colors toge together. Three of the different browns, the dark, dark brown, gray, and light gray. The only one that's not on here is the black because that was all up at the front. So that is big neutral boxes. All right, and then the last one I have to share with you today is uh, foiled rainbow boxes. So every sticker in this, I believe, is going to be a foil. So that is so interesting. I hope that it comes across on camera. We have like the bright red and then like a deeper red. And it looks like we're going through a similar pattern with the boxes. So we have um, four sheets for that colorway. Wow, this is really cool. I haven't even seen some of these foils before. So this is like a brown, like a, closer to like a bronze foil, but then this is like a lighter color. I'm not the best with um, foil colors, but hopefully the colors come across on camera. If you like foil boxes, this is gonna be the book for you because you got every kind of foil under the sun. 
we have like a yellow gold here and then like a little bit more of a muted gold. I feel like that's a little more similar to what we're used to seeing. I'm intrigued by the yellow gold kind of foil. And these are the gray lines as well instead of the black ones. All right. So I kind of, so these boxes, so they are foil, right? Like they're definitely foil, but they almost like, like these you can really tell and the, the light shines off of it. My thing with foil boxes is taking pictures is kind of hard, but I think with these it actually wouldn't be t as difficult because it's kind of like a more muted foil, if that makes sense. So we have a more muted green and then like a super bright green. This like shimmers, this bright green, super beautiful. Now the blues, this like super bright blue and then like a more muted gray toned blue. I feel like that's kind of the theme we're seeing, a bright color and then a more muted color. Purple, I love it. This is like a lavendery purple, light purple, and then like a deep royal purple. And now we have some pink. So we have like a hot pink and then like a super pale gray toned pink. And then at the end we have some silver. Ooh, I'm excited for this next page. Have we ever seen black foil? I'm sure we have, but how interesting. So those are the four books I have from Mojo Jojo Plans. Run, don't walk over to her website to check those out. Uh, and again, use plan your, plan your code. Oh my gosh. Plan your truth for 10% off your order. Super, like the most excited about this one. All right, let's keep going. This will be a longer video, but I really want to share all of these items with you. Next up, we are going to talk about LTL Print House. I have shown some of their stuff before. I'm super excited about their shop because they do incorporate some Mickey elements. So I have two different orders I actually have placed here to share with you. Um, so I have two different freebies there. So let's kind of start. Oh, okay. Let me start with their new set. So... I want to say it starts here. So I got a couple sheets from their new Christmas set. Get this a little bit closer so you can see the colors. We have like a, this is like a lighter green. This is a more rich green here. And this is like a rich red. I love this. And you can already see some little Mickey elements peeking in. Love this washi strip. Okay. Love this sheet. So we have some different things kind of like as borders, different like um, festive borders there. And we do have Mickey elements, like little Mickey bells. I'm in obsessed. I love it so much. I love that sheet. Now we have some sidebars here or some like longer boxes. This one has some lines with presents. This one has May Your Days Be Merry and Magical. Marry everything magic always with lots of Mickey elements. I'm sure you can tell I'm already obsessed. We have some Mickey ornaments and Mickey bell vibes with some different festive things here. Real magic happens during the holidays. Smile from ear to ear. Believe in the magic of the season. And then some different headers here. These sheets are all available individually, but also kind of as a bundle. I just got some of the pages. And then I have some more boxes here to go with this whole collection. Obsessed with this. I'm so excited about this release and can't wait to do a spread with all of those stickers. And then the other order I got from them was during their um, anniversary sale, I want to say. And I very graciously won a 40% off coupon. So I'm super excited about that. Thank you so much to Tina and the team. So we have some gold floor, gold foil florals here. It's really cool. So like if you look at it straight on, they just look like black and white florals. But then you have a little tint of gold there. We have their signature collection floral sheet here. This is on clear sticker paper. Now we have some from the fall collection here. So we have some different pumpkins and like a border here. 
I just thought this collection was really pretty, so I had to have it, even if I won't be able to use it till next fall. Hello Fall, Hey There Pumpkin, and then this is a really cool, like, it's like a sidebar sticker size, but it's all decorative. I really love that. We have some beautiful um, corner florals. The box sheet that matches this fall set. And then we have the washi strip sheet, again, that matches the fall set. So we have fall in love with today over and over again, the pumpkins, the leaves, and the florals there. So that was all from the fall. And then these are from the signature collection, these two sheets. And then I also have their Christmas collection from last year to use. So we have some beautiful florals with Merry Christmas. These are all different stickers here, but I do kind of like them together. I may do that in my planner, but that's three different stickers. Happy Holidays, Tis the Season, Deck the Halls, Merry and Bright. The Washi Strip. What I really like about their shop is they have some things in black and white and some things in color. And like it's you you can get both like this. It, they have they have this page with color. I don't quote me on that, but I believe most of their stuff is like that. Oh, yeah, because look, I got both for this. You see how we have color on this? And this is the same exact sheet in black and white. So I really like that they offer that because some of the things I prefer in color, some of the things I prefer in black and white. And then, like, yeah, these are, oh, no, these are these, oh, yeah, these are, like, the same sheet. I'm, like, blown away. <laughs> so I, I really like that because you can also use them both in one spread and just have more of, of the same kind of sticker but in a different color. So that is their Christmas collection from last year. So I'll definitely leave their shop linked down below. Um, I really love a lot of their designs, so make sure to check them out. And the last thing I have to share with you today is, of course, JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. For this, I'll get you a little bit closer since we have some smaller sheets here. You know how I feel about her shop. I love JoJo. I have two JoJo's I'm sharing with you today. So let's start with this envelope here. I save all of these, by the way. I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but her envelopes are so beautiful. So the these match her... She does like a monthly desk calendar that I have. So she did a set where you have January. This is like exactly what it is on the desk calendar, but you now can put this like in a spread. You could make like a bullet journal spread with this. You could add it to, I don't know. There's a lot that you could do with it. So you have some great washi strips and boxes for January. And then we have the same set here for February. I hope she continues this and does the entire year. I almost want to figure out a way to use them and like put all of them together. I really like that. And then this was um, a free, oh, this is, um, if you subscribe to her newsletter, you get a freebie, it looks like. Love this. And there's definitely a lot more that she has new release wise. Um, so definitely check out her shop. But the other thing that she sent me is her storybook collection number four. I love her storybook collections. This is called The Gingerbread Man. Once upon a time, an old woman decided to bake some cookies. I almost want to like cut this out and use this like as a journaling card. I think that's so pretty. All right. So we first off have like a little freebie sheet with some kitchen items some more kitchen items and these are all hand drawn i mention that every time but just so you're aware they're beautifully hand drawn stickers so it's a lot of like kitchen elements and then we add in like a gingerbread house and a gingerbread man i'm trying to get them close so you can really appreciate the detail you know what i mean on these stickers Ooh, we have some like bread and cheese and grapes. So full on kitchen vibes. Cute. I love her big stickers like this, like to make little scenes with. I really love that. Ooh, now we have a little bit of a winter vibe here with the gingerbread bread man running. And that's like a big sticker. I love big stickers. You have the, the moose, deer, 
Is it a reindeer? <laughs> <laughs> pretend I didn't say anything some different gingerbread man men one is even like broken that's so sad and then some more of the kitchen elements I love big stickers and the bread and cheese so super obsessed with these stickers as well but that is all that I have to share with you I will leave all three of these shops linked down below let me know what all of your thoughts are, what you're excited about picking up. And don't forget, I do have an affiliate link and a code for Mojo Jojo plans. So thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button. If you want to see more of my videos, you can hit that subscribe button. And remember to plan your truth so that you can live your truth. Thanks so much.